Hey guys, today we're gonna to be showing you this really cool little craft box we got at Target. Um, Lily's pretty excited about it, aren't you? Yeah. So it's called a surprise craft box. It has six, eight, sorry, eight surprise crafts in it. And um, we don't really know what they are. So we're gonna open them today and kind of show you what the crafts are. We're gonna show you our artwork on the crafts. The really cool thing about this is this whole huge box with all these crafts was only $10. You guys, seriously, $10. That's eight days worth of fun for your little kid. Um, I highly recommend you go to Target and get one of these craft boxes. All right, we're gonna open it up and get started. After looking at this box, we see there's a little start here. And you just start by pulling it. So we're gonna let Lily open this one and show us what's in there. Ready? Okay, let's do it. So we have to do, start here. We yep, pull it and see what's in there. Okay, here we go. Let's see a blind bag. All right, what do we have? We got something with a puff ball and some stickers and some instructions. Looks like our first craft is going to be a little bird. All right, so we're gonna create this little craft for you and then we'll show you what it looks like when we are done with ours, but everybody can make theirs different. All right, in our box, we've got one pom-pom with a loopy so that we can hang her, hang it up in our room or on our desk. Maybe my my room door. Yeah, that would be great. So we've got the one pom-pom. We've got some googly eyes, some wings, a beak, and then we've got some round things here that are stickies to put the feet on and the, the eyes on. So we're gonna construct our bird and we'll show you when we're done. All right, we got our first craft done. What was it, Lily? It was a bird. It was this crazy little kooky bird guy. Kooky bird guy. Yeah. Her wings are a little crazy on him, but it's cute, easy, super quick, something to do with your kids in the morning. It's a great little craft for them to do. All right, we're gonna check out the next craft now. We're gonna set this guy aside. All right, Lily, go ahead and open up the next box and let's see what's in that craft number two. In here. Nothing. Well, we opened box number two and what was in there, Lily? Nothing. Nothing. So um, we'll have to talk to Target about that, but our hole number two was empty. So we are gonna move on to that means we're going to be short a craft, but we are going to move on to craft number three. What's in there, Lily? In here? Yep. Okay. What is it? It's a turtle. A turtle? Let's check this out. What's in the turtle? It is turtle. a mosaic tile turtle, which comes with a turtle a bunch of tiles to make it your way, and a couple of googly eyes. Let's see what's all in here. We've got, got some it. googly eyes again. We've got one turtle, and we have a bunch of colors. How many colors are on there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 15, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 different tiles we're gonna be able to stick on our turtle. And they're all different colors. What colors do you see on there, Lily? Purple. One purple color. Pink. Pink. And another pink. Red. Red. Orange. Orange. Tan. Green and yellow, right? Yeah. 
lots of fun colors. So we are going to build our purple turtle. Purple and purple and purple and green and green and green. And we'll show you what it looks like. Look at our turtle, does it look so pretty? Did you have fun making that one? Yeah. Kind of got to just stick yeah. the colors everywhere. We got to make a fun little turtle. Look at the googly eyes. Ah. That one's better. That was fun. All right, we're going to be on to craft number four. Let's see what's in there. Okay. It's in box number four. Rainbow. A rainbow. Oh my gosh. Is it a rainbow keychain? Look, we've got fuzzy balls and a rainbow that has a little keychain on it. And rainbow. Who doesn't love pom poms? Looks like this also comes with some googly eyes and a glue pen. Oh, this one is going to be fun to make, huh? Oh, there's googly eyes the rainbow. Yeah. I've never seen a rainbow googly eyes on it. This one is gonna be messy. All right, yeah. so let's see what color pom-poms we have in yeah. here. Yeah, color pom-poms. Oh yeah, color pom-poms. Oh, yeah. yeah, colored pom-poms are fun. So we've got red, Whoa, orange, so cool. yellow, green, and blue. And they match the same as our rainbow. So we're going to do some color matching with this one. Right, Lily? Yeah. Yes, this will be fun. We just finished the rainbow keychain. It's still a little wet, so when we roll it, these are kind of falling off. So I would suggest putting a little bit more glue than you think you would need, just to make sure that they're all gonna stick. And then let it sit and dry so that none of them can roll away. But look at this, you guys. And you can do it however you want. See, Lily put the, wanted to put the eyes on the clouds. Um, in here, it suggests putting them at the top of the rainbow with a little smiley face. I think it looks super cute both ways. I think it works either way or any way you want to do it. Yeah. That was a fun one. Let's see what's in the next box. Go ahead and open the next one. Let's see what's in there, Lily. Let's peek a little bit. Dots? Really dots? Well, so what Lily's talking about is there's some colorful dots. We've got some red, some blue, and some pink dots. Let's see what that goes to. What it looks doing? like... What? Hmm. What is it, tractor? It looks like we are going to be making a little caterpillar. Caterpillar? Ooh. This should be fun. It's where you link the pieces of paper together and to create a caterpillar. So I'm excited to show Lily this. She's never done one like this. So this will be really fun to try out for our first time. Oh, there's little googly There's more googly eyes. Awesome. I think there's googly eyes in everyone. Yeah, and we have a little craft box at home and we probably have thousands of googly eyes in our craft box. So it would be fun to add some more googly eyes if you guys have some at home. Okay, so in here we have five Paper. Thicker pieces of paper, and each one has a little glue tab on the back so we can turn them into circles. So these are our body, and then these five, four pieces are our connectors. So we're going to show you how that all works and how you can get them to loop together like a big caterpillar.
All right, guys, look, we've got this really long chain of paper, which is really cool. See how it kind of looks like a caterpillar? Yeah, now we're gonna decorate it. We've got some googly eyes to go on it, some little antennas, some spots, and it looks like a little happy mouth right here that we're gonna add on too. So here we go, let's add some dots. All right, Lily, how did you feel about building that caterpillar? Well, it took forever. Yeah, this was a really long craft. This was super fun to make. Some of these would be really good to do right away in the morning and just kind of get your day started off. And some of these would be better to maybe do after dinner or during nap time, after nap time. So they take a little bit longer, but it'll be super fun. And Lily had lots of fun building your cow caterpillar yeah. and putting dots on it. That was fun, wasn't it? Did you like that one? Mm-hmm. We are gonna go and check out what project number five is. Okay, right, Lily, go ahead, pull out number five. What are we gonna be doing now? Yeah, I didn't know what it is, so I'm just taking it out. I think it's a pancake. What do you think? Is it a pancake? I don't think it's a pancake. Sun! Oh, fun! We're going to be doing a craft sun. It comes with some sticks and a yellow circle for the sun. Ooh, ooh. A circle for the sun and some some sticks to stick on the, to make some the sunshine rays. Those sticks feel like popsicles and they look like popsicle sticks. And there's also some more googly eyes. We love googly eyes. Yeah. They're so fun. And we forgot to take the last one out. Sorry. Googly eyes. And then this is what we're going to be making. So we keep that glue stick that we had from our other project and we use it to make the sun. We are going to get rocking and rolling on this sun right now. Are you ready, Lily? Yeah. What color sticks are there? What color sticks does it come Yellow. With? Comes with yellow, yellow three, yellow. three yellows. Orange. Three yellows. Two orange. And three. Two orange. And three red. And then we have one, two, three red sticks. This one, it's very important that we let it dry. Lily was sliding it around and her sticks were moving everywhere and there was get, we were getting glue on the table. So we're gonna set this sun apart to let it dry. What did you think about this art project, Lily? Good. Was it fun? Yeah. Which one has been your favorite so far? Hmm, turtle. The turtle was pretty fun. All right, we're gonna, Clean up this glue mess and then we're going to be back to open the project number seven. We are back to open project number seven now that our table is all cleaned up. All right, Lily, what do you think is going to be in number seven? What is it? I, what does it look like? It kind of looks like a tube, like a doop to do. We call these do do do. Can you show them how a do to do works? Yeah. <laughs> but it's we're not making a do to do. We're making a cloud wind sock. Ooh, so we're gonna be making a cloud with lots of frillies hanging off of it. That is gonna be so fun. All right, check it out, Lily. We're gonna do a cloud, and this comes with the blue tube. Looks like a cloud marker. Googly eyes. Looks like a cloud marker. A cloud. Marker. Some stickies. 
circle stickies again. And then we've got a bunch of paper strips. We've got a yellow, a green, an orange, two blues, and a red. I think one of the blues is for the handle on the top, but we're gonna look at the directions and put this thing together. All right, this is a cloud windsock. This one was actually pretty easy to make. It was fairly quickly quick, wasn't it, Lily? Yep, let's put it in. But it'll be fun to hang it outside and watch it blow in the wind. Mm -hmm. When it's a windy day. Yeah, when it's a windy day, which is kind of hard to put it outside in Florida right now because it rains every day and it might get a little wet. So we may have to put it out by the pool maybe. So this is a really cool little cloud wind sock and it didn't take too long. Yeah. And we unfortunately only have a one craft left. Yep. So what is our last craft that we have in the box? Pop that open. We can peel down. Peel down the I don't know, it kind of looks like some kind of wings to me. Wings! What if it's a butterfly? Let's pull out the instructions. What if it's a butterfly? <gasps> it's a mosaic dragonfly. Aww. Ooh, your favorite was the turtle. This is going to be just like that. It's going to be so much fun. So, along with this, we've got the instruction sheet, our wings. One blue pom pom. I like pom pom. One blue popsicle stick. We have a whole sheet of stickers. And. Googly eyes. We got we've got two googly eyes in here. Googly eyes. And two of the round foam stickers again. I wonder what those are for. They must be for the pom-pom and the popsicle stick. All right, let's read the directions and get to work on building this. That? So take a look at all these crafts that came in our box. It was really fun to make all these crafts today. First one we did was this cute little fuzzy bird on a string. And then Lily made a mosaic turtle, which was her favorite. And then we did the, the pom-pom rainbow. And the pencil or the popsicle stick sunshine the fun little caterpillar the cloud wind sock and the mosaic dragonfly i think this was a fun little box and definitely worth the ten dollars we spent on it what do you think lily did you have fun yeah would you buy this box again no it doesn't have those well if it were different crafts would you buy this box again and do it again yeah i would say this one is a thumbs up and we definitely would do this one again yeah thanks for joining us today and i will drop a link um in the comments below for where you can buy your own craft box and have your own little craft day or craft eight days 
Um, it's really up to you, but it was definitely, I would rate this in a B plus. Smash like for more videos.